Today I've got a super easy mod to get dreamy, soft focus images from an old brownie hawkeye. And all you need is a screwdriver. Stick around for this simple hack, coming right up. So a few weeks ago on Labor Day, I picked up a nice Kodak Brownie Hawkeye camera at a flea market. The following week, I was lucky enough to be invited to be the guest on the Negative Positives Film Photography Podcast, episode number 263. One of the hosts of that podcast, Mike Gutterman, has been talking about a modification he made to his Kodak Brownie Hawkeye, and it's one that uh, many of you have probably heard of, some of you may have tried this already, and it is flipping the lens. And when I say flipping the lens, you just take the lens out of the Brownie Hawkeye, flip it around backwards, and shoot images that way. Uh, the big reason people like to do this is it is supposed to give you dreamy, soft focus images, uh, a little bit like a toy camera, and it sounded like a lot of fun. So that's exactly what we're going to do today. We're going to flip the lens. All right, here we've got our Brownie Hawkeye camera flash model. First step to flipping the lens is just to open it up. <clears throat> got a little latch right here. Uh, some models have it on the other side. This one's here, so we're just simply going to open that up. Pull the back off. Take a look inside, and you can see there are simply two little screws we need to loosen up here and here. These are Phillips head screws. Uh, and if you have a screwdriver with a magnetic tip, that maybe wouldn't hurt because uh, these are deeply recessed, so it's going to make it easier to get these back in. So let's go ahead and take these out. There we go. And there is our lens in question. You see there's a little washer in here too. But the lens uh, in its native orientation has the convex surface towards the back of the camera and there's kind of an angled ridge on this housing here. And the part that's facing the front of the camera is a concave surface and this ridge here is flat. So again, it came out of the camera like this. We're simply gonna flip it. So now we have the concave surface facing the back of the camera and the flat ridge again facing the back. So we've flipped it. And we're gonna put this back in. Uh, remember to have the writing here facing up like this, the correct orientation so you can read it like this. You don't want to get it upside down. Let's get the second screw in place and then we'll tighten them up. Okay. Nice and tight. You don't want this assembly here to be uh, loose at all. Might affect uh, issues with the film plane. Nice and tight. Everything fits well. And uh, we just flipped that lens. Now let's fast forward in time and check out the results.
Well, this was a fun experiment, and I did like the results I got on some of those images, but for me, there is one big limitation, and that is that the sweet spot for the focus when you flip the lens is somewhere between two feet and five feet, and again, for the way I shoot, I just found that a little bit limiting. So if you are gonna flip the lens, please keep that in mind. Now, I am planning a more general overview or look at the Brownie Hawkeye camera coming up, so please stay tuned to this channel. Along those lines, if you wanna see more film photography videos like this one, Go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell for notifications. Thanks again for watching, and as always, do some good, have some fun, and shoot some film.